The retired New Jersey principal died on Tuesday in his Gainesville, Florida home after a long battle with illness. By December 30, 2020, 12 19 p.m., Joe Clark, a high school principal who served as the inspiration for the film Lean on Me, has died. He was 82. According to a statement from Clark's family, the retired New Jersey principal died on Tuesday in his Gainesville, Florida home after a long battle with illness. The family did not specify the illness. Get push notifications with news, features and more. Plus follow following you'll get the latest updates on this topic in your browser notifications. Clark was the principal of Eastside High School in Patterson, New Jersey, where his quest to improve the school from within earned him national attention. As the statement from his family recalled, he once expelled 300 students for fighting, vandalism, abusing teachers, and drug possession, in a single day. Roaming the hallways with a bullhorn and a baseball bat, Clark's unorthodox methods won him both admirers and critics nationwide, the statement added. Steadfast in his approach, Clark explained that the bat was not a weapon but a symbol of choice, a student could either strike out or hit a home run. He appeared on the cover of Time magazine in 1988, and a year later, his experiences were depicted on the big screen in the film Lean on Me, starring Morgan Freeman. Clark also published a book, Laying Down the Law, about his educational approach at the New Jersey High School. Morgan Freeman, Joe Clark credit, movie store Shuttershock, born in Rochelle, Georgia, on May 8, 1938, Clark's family moved up to Newark, New Jersey, when he was six years old. After graduating from Newark Central High School, Clark went on to receive a bachelor's degree from William Patterson College, now William Patterson University, a master's degree from Seton Hall University, and an honorary doctorate from the U.S. Sports Academy. Clark also served as a U.S. Army Reserve Sergeant and drill instructor. Clark then started teaching at a Patterson grade school in Essex County, New Jersey, where he also served as director of camps and playgrounds, before he later became principal of PS6 Grammar School. Under his watch, the school that was once, failing, was changed into the miracle of Carroll Street, according to the statement from his family. Never miss a story, sign up for People's free daily newsletter to stay up to date on the best of what People has to offer, from juicy celebrity news to compelling human interest stories. Clark was later hired as principal of the crime and drug-ridden Eastside High School, where his family added that he lifted the expectations of those that remained, continually challenging them to perform better. The disciplinarian even declined a White House policy advisor position, offered by then-President Ronald Reagan, because of his dedication to his students and community, his family wrote.